the BMW 700, a legend of automotive engineering. Introduced on the market in 1959, the BMW 700 was a sporty compact car for the whole family. A compact car, but with a huge impact on the company history of BMW. Roughly speaking, the BMW 700 was the right car at the right time. It had a modern design which was appealing to many people. It had the implied tail fin, typical for that era. The car accommodated four passengers and had a large trunk. The 700 was in such high demand that every customer had to accept a delivery wait of a few months. Der große Wurf für BMW im Augenblick ist der 700er. In 1960, BMW produced more than 35,000 models of the 700 series. For BMW, the successor of the BMW 600 became a huge success. In its first year, the 700 was responsible for 58% of the total sales. BMW showed that it still could build successful cars and smoothed the way for the new class being introduced in 1961. The BMW 700 was designed by the Italian designer Giovanni Michelotti. A two-door sport wagon with modern stylistic elements. A convincing car that fits seamlessly into the portfolio of BMW. At the end of the 50s, the BMW portfolio consisted of the 501, 502, 503, 507 luxury cars and the compact BMW Assetta. A model in between was missing, and that gap was filled by the 700. For this wagon, there is only one norm, Höchstleistung. With its 30 horsepower, it achieved a top speed of 125 kilometers an hour and caused a furor in motorsports. For racing, they teased out 60 horsepower from the two-cylinder boxer engine. With the 700 BMW won the German Mountain Challenge in 1960 and later on the German GT Championship. The BMW 700 was a successful race car because of its low weight and good traction, due to the rear axle engine. Especially for the mountain races, it was very helpful. The car was built until 1965. With approximately 190,000 cars, the 700 has been the most successful BMW to date. Today, the BMW 700 is still a legend of automotive engineering.